Module 9, Segment 1, Working with Document Imaging. In this segment, you will learn how to attach an image to a record, create and assign image codes, and review the functions available for working with saved images. Please note that this training segment assumes you already have basic working knowledge of quantum control. The Document Imaging module allows you to attach files or images to master part records, stock lines, company records, work orders, repair orders, sales orders, warranty claims, contact management records, and stock market or eBay listings. Images can be added from within any of these quantum control modules and attached to stock lines at the point of receipt using the receiving and inspection module or using the lot costing module. These attachments can be of any file type, including bitmaps, JPEGs, TIFFs, spreadsheets, PDFs, or Word documents. Attached images can be easily printed, emailed, exported to a new file location, or viewed both internally and externally. In Training Segment 2, we will review how to access document imaging in each of the modules. Before adding any images, we will first define a list of image codes. Image codes are a user-defined classification system that can be used to classify your stored images. With your mouse, click on the User menu at the top left of the Quantum window and navigate to the System Setup option. Navigate to the Maintain System Tables option and highlight Inventory Control Browses. Select Image Codes. The Image Codes window opens. Select Add and create a new image code. The Adding an Image Code window opens. Type an image code and a description. In our example, we will type Drawing in the Image Code and Description fields. The Print on Shipping checkbox works in conjunction with Quantum Control's Shipping Management module. If selected, stock line images with this code assigned can be made to print automatically during the shipping process. For more information on printing images from the Shipping Management module, please refer to Online Help Chapter 17. In our example, we will uncheck the Print on Shipping box. When finished, select OK. You will be returned to the Image Codes window where you will see your new image code displayed. Close the Image Codes window. The processes for adding images are identical in each of the Quantum Control modules, even though the methods of accessing document imaging will differ slightly. In this training segment, we will work with document imaging in a master part record. To begin, open a master part record. From the master part window, select Global. The Global Options window opens. Select Document Images. The Imaging window opens. This window is organized into two panels. The left panel is a list of all documents and images currently attached to the record. In our example, we see an image labeled Part Photo attached to the Master Part Record. The right-hand panel displays the document or image in the currently selected row on the left. We'll begin by attaching a new image to this part record from an existing file location. Select the Add Action button. The Adding a Document Image window opens. Type a name for the new document or image in the description field. In our example, we will type in Cutaway Drawing. Click on the square in the Image Codes window to access the table. The Image Codes window opens. Double-click on an image code to select it. You will be returned to the Adding a Document Image window. Select OK to proceed. A standard Windows Explorer view opens. 
Navigate to the document or image file you want to attach, highlight it, and click Open. You will be returned to the imaging window where you will see your newly attached image listed on the left panel. Single click to select the image and you will see a preview of the image in the right panel. Once an image has been attached to a record, you can use the Edit Action button to change the description or image code, or the Delete Action button to remove the image. Images can also be attached by scanning documents and pictures. For this, you will need to have a Windows scanning device attached to your workstation. From the Imaging window, select Scan. The Adding a Document Image window opens. Complete the fields in this window as described above and select OK. The Select Source window opens, displaying a list of scanning devices. Highlight the device you wish to use and click Select. Your scanner software will now launch. Scan the image. When scanning is complete, you will be returned to the imaging window. The description of the newly attached image will be displayed in the left panel and the new image will appear in the right panel. Attached images can be printed from the imaging window. To print, select the image from the list and select Print. The image will print automatically at your default printer. Images can also be viewed in an internet browser. Select the image from the list and select Browser. Your default internet browser will open, displaying the image. You will now have access to typical browser functions such as printing, emailing, or opening a new Microsoft Word document containing the image. Saved images can also be emailed as attachments. In the imaging window, select the Email Action button. The Mail Attachment window opens. Type in the email address, a message, and select Send. Attached images can be exported to file locations outside of Quantum Control. Select the image from the list on the left panel, and select the Save As Action button. The Save As window opens. Select a destination for the file, enter a name, and select Save. Your image will now be exported to the new file location. Close the imaging window. You will be returned to the master part record. On the left side of the window, you will see an icon that indicates images are attached. You will see this icon in all of the different record types where images can be stored. You can click on the icon with your mouse and the imaging window will open. To recap what we have learned in this session, we have identified the quantum control modules where document imaging is available. We have added a new image to a record from a file location and by scanning. We have learned how to print, email, and export images. And we have viewed images using a web browser. You may now proceed to Module 9, Segment 2. Accessing Document Imaging in the Quantum Modules.